I'm here with Paul at the PC DJ stand. He's going to talk us through the new PC DJ VJ. Take it away. All right. PC DJ VJ, audio, video, karaoke, playback. One program does it all, with a few special effects as well. Very, very easy to try. See if I can show you. All right, so we've got two main decks. Preview window in the middle. Right, I've got content down here. I've got some video here. Everything's drag and drop. Very simple. So drag and drop the track in. There we go. Plays away. Preview window right there. Right. Got the next track ready. Drag and drop. That's in there. Video cross phase automatic deck to deck. Very, very professional. Now the loads of special effects you can do as well. If you're playing an audio track, no video content, it'll do a series of visualizations for you. The screen never goes blank, it's always doing something interesting. 70 visualizations are standard, and it changes them about once a minute to keep everything fresh. Right. Well, it does karaoke as well. Play a karaoke track, you get the graphics coming out instead of the video. Very easy to do. Okay, I'll put a video back on now. Alright, so play the video. If you've got the controller, you can scratch loop and cue the video at will. No problem. Loops and cues are there. Beat matching's the juggle as well. Let's get another video that's 108 beats per minute. Got one here, 128, I want to beat match that one, I press one button on the screen to match it, done, beats are synchronised, simple as that, drum beats are right on top of each other, do the audio fade, do the video fade, perfect beat matching every time, no skill required, well you still got to know what track to put on next I guess, so you can't get away from that, alright. Now I can do some special effects as well. Let's just concentrate on deck one now. I'll just do the popular effects because there's too many to show really. The most popular ones are webcam, cheap and nasty webcam. All right, we can have that on screen. No problem. There's the live video from the webcam. Very simple, very quick. Punters love that when you're doing karaoke. You put it on in the instrumental break. They think it's brilliant. Well, you can do a slideshow of still pictures as well. Uh, there we are. So you pick your first picture from the hard drive. Now this can be a, a memory card from a digital camera you've just taken pictures on a minute ago. That works really well. And when you're ready, activate. There's the slideshow. Well, while you're doing that, your two main decks are still playing audio and video automatically. All right. And when you're playing video, you can do things to that. For example, there's the video rotation system. It just spins the video around, it just looks nice. This is my favourite, the video cube. Put it on a 3D cube instead. It looks very professional. If you look at the big screen, it actually looks like the reality. Very professional, very clean. A little bit different, yeah? Alright. Another use. What's this? I use this for request. I'll just do a hello mum this time. Alright, there's the position, there's the size, there's the colour. When you're ready, apply. It's on screen. Very quick. Very, very easy to do. But it's, as quickly as you can alter it, it's on screen. That works very well. There's a whole host of audio effects as well, but it's so noisy in here, you're not going to hear them. But you can see on here, 
They're all the different audio effects you can use. There are some useful ones in there. Flanger, uh, vinyl break, backspin, peak break. They're the ones you'll actually use. And they're all on there. There are short, <coughs> shortcuts to these as well. Under each deck is a shortcut for the audio effects here. The video effects are right here. So you don't need to go into the menu to trigger these. For instance, there's the camera. I can trigger it right from there. There we go. No problem. Finally, it's got a superb automatic playback system. They're my video tracks. Put them in the automatic system down here. Drag and drop. Hit auto mix. That's it. It will play back one track after another and it will crossfade the audio and the video for me automatically at the end of each track. Don't need to do anything. And for the video fade, I'm just choosing from this menu what video effect it's going to be when it crossfades. I can show you how that works. <coughs> Five seconds from the end, it will do the crossfade. You uh, just watch the sliders there. There they go. No problem. That's basically BJ BJ.